Okay guys, now we're going to install Super Anti-Spyware. It is a highly recommended program by me. It will block program, it will block, protect you from things that other programs won't. It will remove things that other programs won't also. I'm going to teach you how to make it the lifetime activated version, okay? This is a difficult hack, so I'm going to walk through it reasonably fast, but if you need to pause it and follow the steps as I go along, okay? This is the program. You do not need to download it from here at all. I will give you a link in the description where you need to download it to get the the keygen and the patch that you will need to activate it for lifetime. Okay, so we start off with right here Super Anti Spyware. We run it as administrator. Next, I agree. Next, next. Takes a few seconds to install. Uncheck all these for right now. Next. Finish. Okay. Now we have Super Anti Spyware up here in the corner. As it's running up in the corner, since I have a 64 bit version, I need to patch it still. Okay. So we'll double click on this right here. Yes. Okay. Now at this point, you must exit Super Anti Spyware. Once Super Anti Spyware is exited, you can cop you can copy these. Pretty much done with that. Open the file location. And you can paste them in here. Okay, first we're going to run the patch. We are going to patch it. Patching done. Okay. Exit. Now... As of right now, I don't think I'm going to use the keygen as of right now. I have a couple keys written down, but I suggest you guys use the keygen. We'll see if it works without the keygen. If it doesn't, I'll go back through and remake the video. So let me pause it for a second while I get the written down info I need. Okay guys, I'm back. As I patched it and it's not working in it as it is as I exited as I exited the program I patched it. After the patch you would open up the keygen, use the keys from the keygen and once it goes to lifetime I'll show you from there. But as of right now, I'm going to try something different. I am going to open up Super Anti Spyware. We want to register, activate it. Next, registration number. This is what I'm talking about here. One eight six three nine four O oh, five nine four. If this doesn't work, I will be doing it the other way. This is a temporary way I'm doing it for right this minute instead of using the keygen. Activation code paste. Copy, 
paste. Copy. Paste. Okay, let's see. Not to be valid. Okay, so that did not work. I am going to have to use the keygen also. Here we go. No problem. No problem. Two, six. Two, nine, seven. Seven, six, eight, three. Next. Fuck. Sorry, guys. Give me a minute, I'm trying to do this as fast as possible. Lifetime subscription active, okay? Now before you do anything, I highly suggest you exit this right here. Exit out the program. You can delete these because you're not going to need these anymore. Okay. Now the big trick here is editing your host file. You're going to add this line to your host file. If you see your host files located in Windows, System32, Drivers, etc. If you noticed, I have a shortcut to that for editing the host file for a couple. Now we want to edit with notepad. If you don't have notepad installed you can edit it with notepad plus plus. Okay we'll paste and we will file Save. Make sure you save it as is, not as a text file. Close. Okay. That's it. We're going to exit out of there. Super anti spyware. Still a lifetime subscription. Checking for us. Updates, authenticating, downloading. I'm going to light up a cigarette as this does what it does. I'm cold, baby. Where's the lighter? I got it. The lighter, baby. I got it. Thank you. Okay. Since it's updated, you're good. We can close this. You still have the lifetime subscription. Now we have to update the product. Next. Next. Now we're downloading a whole new 
we're downloading a whole new a whole new program you would think that will reset it but no when I start up it will be the lifetime version again I'm gonna have to stop it for right now restart the PC and I'll be back when it restarts <clears throat> okay guys we're back from the restart I'm gonna make this quick just to show you it restarted, it installed the new version, and we still have the lifetime subscription activated. Check for updates. We have the most current updates. That's about it. Okay, simple as apple pie, baby. Another DBI release. I'll put the info in there and put the link for the download torrent you need for the the Keygen and the patch. And if you're running 64 bit, the registr registry key. And I will also add in the description what you will be adding to the host file. Since that will not be coming with the download, this is a hack I figured out on my own. Enjoy.